Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Star Wars Roast. Please welcome to the stage your host for the evening, Eddie Firth and Ryan Pig. Hello, everybody. Hello. Oh, this is my mic. Whatever. Guys, this is Ryan Pig. This, thank you. This is Eddie Firth. And tonight, in this world, we roast Star Wars. <laughs> that video is exactly the, what it's like working with Ryan. All the time. Because we're always high, guys. And now we can say that out loud and we won't be arrested. <laughs> it, was, it was really hard to edit that video. It was really hard to find humor, I guess, this week in general. Because, mm -hmm. you know, we elected someone as evil as like Palpatine and someone as racist as Jar Jar to be our president. <laughs> and he only would have been more racist if Michael Jackson had gotten to play him. Is that right? Oh, that's right. They were going to do that. That was some inside baseball. I, th I think they know. Yeah. Guys, we have an incredible lineup for you tonight. You're yep. going to see some amazing comedians roast Star Wars. We got Julian M. Stern, guys. He's back. You guys will see Brody Reed. <laughs> Ptolemy Slocum's here. Keep laughing. Keep clapping. Kyle Clark and John Ungaro are in the house. Both of them. Bill Dixon is here, guys. Keep clapping. You guys have got a chance to see Scout Durwood. Alan Strickland Williams. I know it's a long list. Keep clapping, guys. We can do it. And Andy Erickson is here tonight, guys. We, we did it. We did it. We're here in a comic book store roasting Star Wars. You're wearing a bow tie. We couldn't be more nerdier. <laughs> I, feel, I, feel like, I feel like the big news that we should be talking about is the article that, was, that came out today. Huffington Post reported that um, Carrie Fisher has admitted to having a very passionate and heated affair with Harrison Ford on set while they were shooting those movies. What? Yeah. That's great news! Because <laughs> we all expected that. <laughs> yeah, but to know that they actually did feels good. Oh, it feels so great. A little glimmer of light. <laughs> I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> fixes everything. Does it? It does. Fixes a little. Do you know when the first time you saw Star Wars was? Like, what's your, first, what's your earliest memory of Star Wars? I don't know how old I was, but it was pretty crazy that I saw that before Star Trek because my mom's an actual Trekkie. <laughs> Wait, did you mean she's, she's on the show? <laughs> An Fuck actual, her! When you say uh, actual, what does that mean? Like she's legit a Trekkie. I think she has oh. the ears. But she wasn't on the show. What? She wasn't on the. She wasn't That's on. That's not Star what a Trekkie Trek. means. Is that I'm what a Trekkie just... means? No. Wait, are you guys Trekkies? <laughs> Everyone's just like, we want to see. We hate Star Wars, so we're. Wait here a to minute. See is this not the Star? Is this not the Star Trek roast? Am I at the wrong roast? Yeah. Whoops. Well, uh, no, but that was surprising. And my dad hates um, anything that's fictional, I think. so. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Although he does like the Bible, so I yeah. guess that's, <laughs> that's a whole different thing. <laughs> um, <laughs> but no, that was surprising. Well, when did you first uh, hear of Star Wars or watch Star Wars? My, br my brother was a big fan, so we had all the action figures, and we watched those movies constantly. In fact, I, for a long time, I thought all three movies were one movie. I didn't really know there was a difference. I just, there was a lightsaber. Oh, and occasionally teddy bears showed up. <laughs> but my first exposure was actually through Muppet Babies. Because <laughs> they used to do great sketches about it and insert footage from the movie into the cartoon. Oh my God, that was the cool, I, was, I didn't realize I really liked Muppet Babies more than Star Wars. I just thought it was one and the same. The only reason I knew that is because you bring it up every time we smoke weed together about, and we talk about, whenever Star Wars comes up, you're like, uh, Muppet Babies, this is the first time I saw Star Wars. Like, you're bragging about it. I watch Muppet Babies, no big deal. It's not on Netflix, so. One of the few. But it, it's, it's, what was, what it's definitely it? on YouTube, and I've watched it a lot, so. Who, who is Star Wars, or who is Darth Vader in the Muppet Babies? Just someone, one of them dressed up? I think it was Gonzo. 
or was it oh, Gonzo? Yeah. The no, because the yep. I Look, that. very similar to what you guys just saw. Star Wars and Muppet Babies are a vague memory that exists in my head, but I don't know the actual <laughs> details of it because I was six when I was watching it. You know? Oh yeah. I don't have it laid <laughs> out <laughs> clearly. Uh. We, I'm really excited for this show, though, because, like, we've... Oh, shit, it's been two years. Yeah, that's right. This we've is our doing... two-year anniversary show. <laughs> Me, Eddie, and Sammy Junio started a We year, have two been years roasting ago. people who can't talk back to us for two years now. Can't sue us is the important thing. <laughs> they can't sue us. And they, yeah. Um, I, I don't know about you, but I'm ready to bring out someone special. So here's the deal. We're going to roast all of Star Wars, okay, but we on. need someone to sit right here and take the brunt of it. And there's only one person I can imagine who needs to sit here and take the heat from everybody. So welcoming to the stage, put your hands together for Darth Vader. Ladies and gentlemen, one of the most powerful Jedi's <laughs> in, in the galaxy. <laughs> Who the fuck broke my chair? It's good. <laughs> oh my Don't. god, I realize you guys can't tell I'm smiling. <laughs> I'm just like, why are you so like, at Darth me? Vader is really angry at us. There you go. I put the pen there. Do you need. What if I put another chair up here for all your stuff? That would be good. Good. <laughs> do that. I made you do that. Where was I? Uh, I don't know. What? Uh, do I just sit here? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. If you want anything, let us know. Okay, I'll let you know. We're being really nice to Darth Vader. I just realized that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Darth, now that I have the opportunity to, to talk to you face to face, I've always wondered how you came about like your wardrobe choice. Is, is there a specific design that you went through to get here? Um, I was just like, make me look like a black tampon. <laughs> <laughs> uh, put on some buttons. Nailed it. Nailed it. Yeah. <laughs> but don't, don't get into my material. <laughs> I'm going to talk about it. <laughs> in like t two or three hours or whatever. Are there, are there any planets, this is a stupid question I'm going to ask, uh, <laughs> are there any other planets you want to destroy? Oh God. I almost said Earth. <laughs> <laughs> we're like, we're no, all there right now. That's where you are. Not this one. Don't worry guys. Unless, uh -huh. unless anyone makes fun of my mom. <laughs> <laughs> we might be in trouble. <laughs> she seemed like a sensible woman. Yeah. <laughs> for the, you know, 20 minutes we saw her. You ready for the, you ready for your first roster? Yeah. Cool. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Darth Vader. Yeah. 